Hi guys, in today's video, let's talk about movies in English. First of all, do you like watching movies? Because I love watching movies. So I can call myself a movie fanatic or a movie buff. A fanatic is somebody who loves something to the point of addiction. For example, if you love soccer, then you can say you are a soccer fanatic. There are many words that we use for movies. For example, we can call it a motion picture, a film, or a flick. So for example, you can say to your friend, did you watch the new film by David Fincher? Also, there are many genres of movies. For example, we have action movies like The Avengers or Iron Man. Horror movies like Conjuring or Insidious. The pronunciation of genre is very hard. It's actually a French word genre and je and genre it's uh, between G and J and it sounds like je, je. So genre. The story of a movie is called the plot and a great movie always has a great plot. When we go to the movie theater, or otherwise known as the cinema, we usually buy the tickets online or at the box office. When we say the movie did very well at the box office, it means it made a lot of money. It sold a lot of tickets. A movie is usually written by the screenwriter. So what a screenwriter writes is called the script. We also have the producer who takes care of all the finances of the movie. And we have the director or director of the movie who directs all the actors and actresses and also the production crew. He is like the king of a movie set. I'm the king of the world! <laughs> we use the word starring to talk about certain movies with specific actors or actresses. For example, the movie La La Land is starring Emma Stone and Ryan Gosling. Actresses like Emma Stone are referred to as A-list celebrities. The movie La La Land is very famous for its soundtrack, the music of the movie. I like to read reviews before I choose a movie and the person who writes reviews are called the critics. One famous critic that many people know is Roger Ebert. And Roger Ebert and another critic created the phrase two thumbs up. A movie that is two thumbs up is a great movie. This week, the Fast and the Furious franchise is back with another movie called the fate of the furious. The budget for this film is $250 million. So movies with big budgets are also called blockbusters. It is also a star studded movie, meaning there is not just 
one or two famous actors, but many famous actors. For example, it's starring Dwayne Johnson, Vin Diesel, and Charlie Theron. In 2017, there are many movies that I am anticipating, looking forward to. For example, there is the new movie by Christopher Nolan, the new Spider-Man movie, and also the sequel to the Pirates of the Caribbean series. What movie are you anticipating this year? Please tell me in the comments down below. So now, let's just go over some of the vocabulary that we learned in this video. So a movie fanatic is someone who really likes movies. Genre is the type of movie such as action, sci-fi, and so on. The plot is the story of the movie. And the box office is where we buy movie tickets. Someone who writes movies is called the screenwriter and he writes the script. The word starring is used to talk about the actors and actresses in the movie and famous actors and actresses are also called A-list celebrities. Soundtrack is the music of the movie and reviews are critical articles or reports about a movie. Critics write these reviews and a star-studded movie means a movie with many famous actors and actresses.